aftermath of the war led to an ambitious project of Slavic unity. The establishment of the Kingdom of Serbs, Croats, and Slovenes in 1918, later renamed Yugoslavia, was seen as a beacon of hope for a unified South Slavic identity. However, idealism soon collided with reality. The amalgamation of diverse cultures and historical rivalries, especially between dominant groups like the Serbs and Croats, led to internal strife. King Alexander I, in a bid to mitigate these nationalistic tensions, centralized power in the late 1920s. This strategy, rather than stabilizing the nation, intensified political divisions, culminating in his assassination in 1934. This event further underscored the fragility of Yugoslav unity.